rolling. Hey guys, I'm Matthew Cowling, and today I'm reviewing the Cineskates. But where did I put them? <laughs> Gertrude. Sorry. Welcome to Geek Beat. So this is the Cineskates camera system. And what it is was, it was actually a Kickstarter project where they needed to raise $20,000 to get the first production run going. Amazingly, they raised over $485,000. So it seems like a lot of people have an interest in this project. So what it is, is it's a Gorillapod Focus with a Joby ball mount. But the real kicker to this Kickstarter project is the new Feet by Synetics. So these specially designed feet are actually rotatable skateboard wheels. So you can rotate them and set them into a variety of different positions for straightforward shots or for rotating shots. You can really just use your imagination. So as we were testing it out here at the studios, we noticed a few things. First was the weight issue. It says that it's rated at supporting over five pounds, but I find that pretty unlikely. We were using the Canon VIX EFR test, and we found that any more force given to let the thing go forward would cause the whole thing to kind of buckle. I think it has a problem with the flexibility that it has with these Gorilla Pods. It really just lets it sink and sink because it's so flexible. But really, if you have a light camera like the Canon Vixia, a flip camera style like this, or even a DSLR with a small lens on it, it'd probably work OK, but you've got to watch your weight. Another thing is about the wheels. You have to rotate them to get them in exactly the right angle you want to do either a straight shot or a certain curved shot. But there's no markings on the side to let you know that you're at a perfect 90 degrees, like on the orbit dolly. The wheels are pretty tricky to get lined up correctly. And even when you think you have them lined up, it'll just skid in the middle of your shot. And you'll definitely see that in your film. But if you do have it on a flat surface and you have the wheels lined up correctly, you can get some pretty cool shots. So the Cineskates are $300, and honestly, for the price, I'm not blown away. It's really for those niche shots, the ones that you really need to be creative with. And honestly, I think that's where it shines. We were just playing around with it in the office, and we really started to come up with some creative ideas that I think you wouldn't normally have come up with with just a traditional tripod. So for a full written review, go to geekbeat.tv slash Cineskates. And Cinetics is actually giving one of these away. So check out the blog to find out how you can win. And have you subscribed to our YouTube channel yet? YouTube.com slash GeekBeatTV. If you haven't, I'm going to tell Callie. Anyways, I'm Matthew Cowling, and keep it classy. And have you, you haven't even subscribed yet, have you? I'm going to go tell Tally. <laughs> Tally. <laughs> Gertrude, give him back. Sorry. <laughs> what do I do? So you can't use any of my bloopers, because I just cuss immediately. Yeah. <laughs>